Hello, Dr. E-Learning users. This is Prasoon. In this demonstration, I will show you how you can automatically translate an uh, Articulot Storyline 360's enhanced docx translation file directly into another language. Let's uh, look at this course, which was created in uh, actually created in English, and let's have a quick preview of the same. Here, as you can see, uh, as a course loads, there are some multimedia on-screen text. And as you begin the course, there are some videos that are playing. And then there are some on-screen text. Then as you go ahead, there are a few more videos. Uh, there's some videos with embedded text within the video that is out of scope. But then there are some quizzes uh, created in Articulate. Um, and now let's see what we can do further. Now, what I should do is that, let me go ahead and close the preview. And from here, we'll translation, go to the translation option and we export to Word. So um, let's uh, call this, let's save this file. Now your docx translation file has been saved to your local folder. All right, it's opening here and we can see that uh, these are some of the text. Uh, there's a source text and there's a translation text which is in English. Now, as you will use the tool, you will notice that in translation, it will get converted to a language of your choice. In this demo, we'll be using Spanish and we will see that. Now, as a next step, I will log in into drelearning.com, create my own account. And then once you have logged in, you will find this option to translate. So I'll press start translating. And over here, I'll create a project. Let me call it sales project. You can give any name, press enter. And then you can choose this file that we had saved. So it goes into the documents folder. It is demo Spanish. I'll open this file. And then I'm going to upload this file into the Dr. E-Learning system. It'll take a few, a few minutes. Uh, and as you can see, this project is over here. Now I'm gonna go and manage this project. As you go to manage project screen, you'll see some statistics. And then you can press this translate button. And here you have choice of various languages. In fact, a lot of languages are over here. Uh, we may come here and choose uh, Spanish, which is over here, and then simply press generate. Now you will see that there is this transition status pending. The background, this process will run. Uh, it will take this file and analyze the translated columns and then convert it into the language of your choice. So this is done. So I'm going to download this file now. So you see uh, a prefix of ES has been put. This is your translated uh, file. Let's have a quick look at it. So as you see, uh, if you go down, see on the right hand side, you will see it has been translated into Spanish by AI. Of course, the known caution is that AI translation may not be accurate. So I'm assuming you will give it to somebody to really uh, go ahead and correct. So you save a lot of cost because you don't have to really go into the first cut translation. So the problem of translation now gets converted to problem of editing. And if that's something important to you, this tool will be of immense use. Now, anyways, let's go ahead and import this file into our project. So I come here and I, so the general advice is that make a copy of a storyline project. Don't do it on your original one. However, I'll go to import, translation, sorry. And in translation, I'll import. And I'm going to import this Spanish version. I'll open this. It will start importing. And it happened quite fast. Uh, 
Now let's we can already see you know gracias and everything. So it appears to be in Spanish. Let's have a quick uh, review of the same. Yeah. So let's see now. All right. So start. It is converted it to Spanish now. Of course, this video did not have uh, the text in articulate, but it was embedded within the video, so you can't do much here. But if you want to look at the quiz now, this thing is there in Spanish. And choose your stuff and try things out. Yes, so that is it, guys. Uh, a tool which takes your articulate docx file and converts into a language of your choice i hope some of you will find it very useful and if you do please sign into doctor learning and make use of this good feature thank you so much